What's up guys, Hao Nguyen here for OG Fitness and in this video I want to talk to you guys about why supplements are bullshit. So before I get into it, just take a second to give this video a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Okay, so why do I say that? Well, I started, um, I'm in the middle of doing my personal trainer uh, certification at the YMCA and um, so I'm almost done with that and that's what I'm gonna do for a living from, from now on. I'm gonna train people and you know, anything that has to do with uh, uh, fitness and martial arts basically. But there's a section uh, where we, uh, towards the end of the first book, right? Um, and it talks about you know supplementation and shit like that. And this is like the latest studies, right? <laughs> and they're, they're all bullshit. They're all bullshit. None of them are proven to work. Even creatine is, uh, it's like it works, but you know, um, the problem with creatine is that they don't even know like the long-term side effects yet, okay? Like I know that supposedly it's been um, uh, like tested a lot and stuff like that. But the thing is, I think sometimes they have to, what they have to do is um, test it over uh, a big time uh, span, right? To, to make sure that it's actually safe. So it's not conclusive that it's safe for you. But I think that's the only thing that works. Everything else is just fucking bullshit. Like it's not proven, you know? So all these supplement companies, uh, what they're doing is they're trying to get your money. And so, you know, everyone's out, everyone's looking out for their interests, right? And of course, if you buy into that, then unfortunately, <clears throat> you're, you're the sucker. And a lot of guys on, on, on YouTube, I think also, like in the, uh, the fitness uh, industry, they, you know, they sell their own supplements and shit like that. And I believe that supplements are bullshit because, well, it's, it says it in the book. It's, it's the latest studies, right? And, uh, and also, the way I see it is that if you're not an elite, elite athlete, like you have less than 10% body fat and you're at the elite level where you're, and when I say elite, I mean international uh, level, com you're competing at the international level or you're at the Olympics and you're training like fucking, uh, um, how do you say it? I don't know, six, eight hours a day or some crazy shit like that. Or if you're a, you do, you're a professional athlete and once again, that would mean you're probably training something like uh, twice a day, for you know four to six hours you know um, and you have very low percentage body fat and and you know unless you're at that level and plus like your 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 nutrition is already top-notch so you're eating all the right foods at the right time uh, you know like everything is is highly uh, optimized then and only then do you need to you know maybe supplement and it would where and that's when it would actually make a difference but for me and you, for older guys, uh, or even younger guys who aren't professionals or super elite uh, level athletes with super low percentage body fat who, are, who aren't training like uh, uh, six, eight hours a day, uh, six days a week, it's pure bullshit. You could just fucking eat. So that's really what I think, uh, that's my take on it. And I don't take any supplements at all, at all nothing and um, I feel fine like I think the, the important thing is to optimize your nutrition so to eat whole foods healthy foods for you right you know like get your uh, get your macros in so uh, your your proteins your fats your carbs uh, ideally your carbs you want to get clean carbs so nothing processed and nothing that's gonna spike your insulin uh, just a side note there uh, you know get a lot of fats healthy fats that whatever any kind of fats it doesn't matter and um, and, um, and then yeah, get enough protein. But even protein, you don't even need that much. Like you need like fucking, uh, I think it's like one gram per, per pound of body weight. And even then, that's more like if you're an athlete. You don't actually need that much protein. It's, you know, it's, it's, it's counterproductive. But that's for another video. So honestly, like just, if you just optimize your, your nutrition, okay? And uh, you just, and also you optimize your sleep, and you know, try to like control your stress levels, right? Manage your stress. Then, then you're good, man. I mean, you're gonna recover properly. You're gonna be strong. You're gonna do your workouts. You'll make your gains, and uh, you'll see improvement and stuff like that. And supplements, it's just a waste of money. And um, yeah, so everybody's out to make a buck. 
uh, with all these supplements. But um, one thing I want to add though is that there is uh, vitamins and minerals and shit like that that might be something to look into, you know, because for example, omega freeze, you know, which is uh, super healthy for you, but that uh, we don't get enough of, okay, even in fish now, so because a lot of the fish is uh, farm raised. So if they're farm raised, they don't have any omega free. So you have to find ways to get your omegas free in. So you could supplement with omega free, uh, you know, pills. But those are more like vitamins and minerals and, and, and stuff like that. You know, like when I when I say supplements are bullshit, I'm talking about all the other stuff that they're they're trying to sell to guys like you know, uh, protein, uh, glutamine, uh, uh, creatine, and and all and uh, what do you call it? Um, mass gainers and, and and shit like that. You know, mostly for bodybuilders and guys who want to make gains, like all, all that stuff. I mean, it's all it's all garbage, you know. Uh, unless you get like super high quality stuff and you're at the level of uh, you know uh, international elite Olympic professional, then yeah, sure, it, it probably will make a difference, but probably just a slight difference, you know. I'm guessing. Um, so, anyways, but omega threes, vitamin D, uh, maybe magnesium, and a couple of things. But I mean, to to, to get that right, you'd have to read up uh, a lot more on it. Uh, probably have to get some. Uh, what do you call it? Uh, blood work done, okay? S talk to a doctor, a dietitian, nutritionist, you know, to evaluate, to see like if you're actually deficient, what's the ideal, um, um, how do you say it? Uh, the ideal amount that you need to supplement, you know, you have to be careful with, uh, a little bit about that. And also there's a new thing now where, um, I haven't looked it up yet, but uh, it's, it's called, uh, well, it's ge genetics, right? So they could, uh, there's companies out there that will uh, how do you say it? analyze your your genetic makeup and then from there it, it really drills down on what's the best for you what foods you should be eating what foods you should avoid and uh, you know I think that's the next level uh, that's where that's where all this fitness and nutrition stuff is gonna go eventually it's it's because with the advances in science and all the discoveries and everything now I mean yeah they're able to, to really really see what's optimal for you and everybody's different okay so all that to say that, listen, don't waste your money on fucking supplements, man. Just eat, train hard, and if you're hungry, eat a little bit more, and you'll be okay. Uh, you don't you don't need that much protein. You don't you don't need none of that shit. Like uh, I'm starting a program at this point where I'm like I'm working out three times a week. Well, that's my usual thing, three times a week in uh, in judo and wrestling, and then I'm working out four times a week in the gym. Okay, so four times a week in the gym plus three sessions of uh, grappling a week. And uh, all I do is eat well, okay, sleep well, and uh, that's about it, man. And I feel great, I recover uh, really good, and I think it has a lot to do with those two things there. It's uh, your nutrition and your recovery. So when I talk about reco well, recovery, you have to eat and sleep properly to recover well, right? But you gotta train hard, but you gotta recover hard also. So that's it for this video. I just wanted to put that out there for you guys. Um, my opinion on supplementation. I think supplementation is highly, highly, highly overrated to the point where it's practically bullshit, you know, because they make all these claims and all these fitness guys on YouTube and stuff like that. It's, it's all about like selling their shit. And uh, I, you know, nothing against people trying to make a buck. But what I what I don't uh, don't want to be a victim of is I don't want to be the sucker. Uh, I've been a sucker in the past, uh, like everybody, right? Because these guys are very convincing when they, and you know they're all big and jacked and shit like that, and then they tell you, oh yeah, blah blah blah. But if you look at the real science and shit like that, like nah, man, I think unless you're you're super high level athlete with very low body fat, and you know of course you're training uh, six eight hours a day. You don't need supplementation, man. Just fucking eat. You know, most likely all that supplementation is just making a, uh, uh, you're just being a sucker, okay? People are taking advantage of you. Uh, it's burning a hole in your wallet. And if you're taking too much mass gainer and shit, you're just fucking getting fat, you know? And you don't want to get fat when you bulk up. When you, when you, you want to make gains, but you want to make uh, clean gains, you know? You want to, you want um, lean muscle mass type of gains. You don't want to, put on fat that doesn't fucking make sense because that brings up uh, a whole host of other problems so that's it guys just just focus on your on your recovery on your sleep 
and on your nutrition and work out hard, that's all you ever need. I'm fucking 40 years old and you know, well, like I showed in this video, you guys see it in the other videos where I have my shirt off. Fuck, I look fine and I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna get bigger so I'll keep you guys posted on what's going uh, on with uh, my workout and where I'm at. Right now, I'm just starting off so when you start off uh, like a program, okay, uh, there's phases to it, okay? You just don't just jump in and oh yeah, uh, uh, like I'm just gonna go heavy or okay, I'm doing, uh, I'm gonna do a lot of rep, like there's a, there's, a, there's a reasoning behind it, okay? So right now I'm just at the beginning, so at the beginning I'm doing a lot more endurance. After that we're gonna get close, we're gonna, um, how do you say, it? increase the, uh, the weights, drop the, the repetitions a little bit, okay? And then after that we go into rep ranges, you know, depending on, on uh, where I'm at. Like the way it works is that you wanna start off more or less, okay? Just an overview here, but endurance, uh, once, once you're done with your endurance phase, you have to unload a little bit, okay? So you have to take a little step back, and then from there, okay, you start off again, but you're, now you're not in uh, endurance anymore, you're in, um, uh, how do you call it, uh, hypotrophy. Then after that, after hypotrophy phase, you gotta back off a little bit, boom, and then you go back to uh, strength hypotrophy. Then you back off a bit, boom, then you go into um, uh, strength. And then you back off, and then depending on your goals, if you're an athlete or not, then you can go into power, uh, you know, speed, strength, and, and shit like that. But this this all has to do with periodization. And so, okay, this video is going on a little bit too long. I'm going off a little bit on a tangent, but basically, supplementation is bullshit. And I'll 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 show you guys like uh, how big, uh, you know, like how you could look just doing without supplementation, just by eating and stuff like that. In, in a couple of months, you know, probably in about three months or six months and stuff like that, I think the gains are gonna be good and they're gonna be clean, uh, no body, no, no excess fat, you know? Uh, and of course, so that's it, man. You know, I, I, I really believe supplements is, um, eh, you know, that, okay, that's it for now, guys. Thanks for watching and uh, please uh, like, comment, subscribe if you haven't already and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.